Hey everyone, today is Tuesday, February 22nd, 2022. We have five new mods to take a look at. Not a lot, kind of a, a small mod day. And we have some, uh, well, some news on on the season pass that I'll I'll share with you today. But first, let's let's get in and take a look at these mods. The first new mod of the day is the Lizard 1184-40. This will be 1.49 megabytes to download and install. $89,000 takes up five slots, 135 horse. Um, I'm not really sure why this is Lizard branded. I'm assuming this is a Ford. So they uh, rebranded it Lizard. Let's take a look at this in the store. <clears throat> so we'll bring, we have Continental, BKT, Fredestein, Michelin, Trellerborg, Nokian, Midas, uh, Lof Lofsfors, <laughs> and back to Continental, we have Standard, Twins, that's that, I'm, I'm assuming, whoops, Standard, Wide, Michelin, Standard, Wheel Weights, and I'm sure with these, no, we don't have no options with those. Okay. Fender configuration, we have standard. We have extensions. Attaches, we have standard. We have front weight. Plus front linkage. Back to standard. Design color. You can have any one of these colors here. Like that. Oh, wait a minute. Okay. So, wait. What does that change? Design color. Hmm. Oh, okay. So I guess that could... No, it doesn't. What does this change? I don't... No idea what the design color is, guys. I don't see anything... changing... at all in there, so... I don't know, that's the Lizard 1184-40. Next up, we have the Ferizin PF 1.13. This is gonna be 2.01 megabytes to download and install. $30,000 is the cost of it. it. Takes up four slots. 13,000 liters of TMR this will make. And that's it, just another cute little TMR mixer. As the furs in PF 1.13. This is the Stroutman Magnon Pack. This is a whopping 51.87 megabytes to download and install. You get three of these forge wagons, as you can see. We have the CFS 430, which is $100,000. This is going to take up 12 slots and holds 40,000 liters. We have the CFS 470 coming at $120,000, takes up 12 slots. 44,000 liters. And we have the CFS 530, which also takes up 12 slots and is 50,000 liters. So the, uh, the 470 is 120,000 and the 530 is 132,000. Four configurations. We have Wilbrand, we have Michelin, BKT, Vredestein, and back to Michelin. Wheel setup, we have standard, we have wide tires. Roto cover, we have no and yes. Uh, okay. It looks like it's possibly on the inside. Yeah, yeah right there, that, that little bit right there is the roto cover. Cover, no and yes. Of course, silage additive tanks. You can add those. And you can have your license plate. That is the Stroutman. Magnon CFS 430 Dio. I'm going to assume that the rest of these are pretty much the same. We're going to take a look at these really quick. Cover, yes, they have all the same configurations as the first one. Okay, here we have the big bag and support package. This is going to be 3.58 megabytes to download and install. Um, so what we have here is we have a seed bag coming at $3,000. This is 1.5 thousand liters, holds, uh, takes up two slots. Fertilizer bag is $2,100. And 
and this is also 1500 liters takes up two slots and this is the big bag winch eight thousand dollars takes up three slots so these are the uh the two special bags for this here let's take a look so we have attached type front loader telescopic loader wheel loader back to front loader main color you can have anything you want on there like that there let's take a look at these is up no configuration for these that's that this is the big bag and support package and finally we have the small liquid tank this is going to be 1.49 megabytes to download and install we have liquid fertilizer herbicide bond silage silage additive and we have diesel tanks and these are all 1000 liters they all take up two slots the silage additive twenty four thousand three hundred dollars for a thousand liters wow the diesel tank four thousand two hundred fifty and so basically these are one thousand liter capacity but they're a much smaller version of it so we're gonna just buy one of these here and take a look out in the field yeah you can clearly tell that it's uh it's quite a bit smaller than the average one you know we should probably buy the regular one just to compare here we can do that real quick and as you can see it's quite a bit smaller so guys those are the mods for today but we're not really done we do have something else to talk about today give me one second so as of today farming simulator announced the very first dlc of the season pass they welcome Antonio Carraro. We're extending the fleet of machines for your vineyards, orchards, and grassland activities. So basically, the very first DLC is going to be all about grapes and olives. It's going to be all small machinery, small small tractors to get around them, um, and equipment, all for grapes and olives. And... Um, not knocking anybody who, who does grapes and olives on this game but for me this is exactly why i never buy the season pass for farming simulator i know that may sound not good to say considering that i'm i'm you know in the giants partners program but it's true i mean that that dlc i don't know it doesn't resonate with me i don't think it's going to resonate with a ton of people i think a very small population of the community is going to be that much in to grape salads that they're going to want a dlc specifically for it it just seems like such a specialized dlc to me um that I, I don't know but you know what i want to know your thoughts so drop in the comments below what do you think about the announcement of the very first dlc for the season pass are you excited about new grape and olive equipment or do you think this is something that you uh you could pass on for me, it's a definite pass. With that being said, guys, thank you so much for watching. Hope you all had a fantastic day, and we'll see you next time.